Hello everyone, today I'm doing a review of the Slate Notebook made by the company Blackwing. So let's get started. I think Blackwing's a company that's actually famous for their pencils, but they also make these pretty little black notebooks. So let's check it out. So the dimensions on this one are 5 by 8.5 inches or 13 by 21 centimeters. So it is the exact same size as a um, large moleskin. And um, it comes with elastic strap. Looks like decent quality here, like nicely done. And pretty sturdy in the back here. And tight. That's what I meant. And then it has a bookmark. Looks pretty nice too. Uh, let's actually take this off. This is a um, dot grid notebook with 5mm dots spacing in between. And what's unique about this notebook is that it has um, a pen loop on the spine. And I've never really seen this before. I think that's pretty cool. It comes with the 602 Blackwing pencil. So you get the pencil and the notebook when you order it, which I think is pretty cool. And it is a canvas spine, as you can see right there. And then the actual cover is a PU leather. You can see right there. It's a little bit bunchy there, but it doesn't affect how the notebook um, lies open, lies pretty flat, stitched and bound, as you can see. And um, rounded edges. It's a hard cover, so it doesn't have too much give. So here the rounded edges, and then the paper is rounded as well. And there's just a millimeter of overhang, so it looks pretty good to me. Oh, here's the back. It just says Blackwing on the back. And I like the stitching right there. I think it makes it look really classy and like high quality. So, and then it's, um, this is a pew leather. It's a um, little bit of texture there, but it feels pretty soft. It has a little bit of give to it, so it feels really nice in your hands. And let's open it up so you can put your name in here, an email, and some notes. And then it has um, this notebook log right here, one table of contents, just this one page with date, content, and what page it is on. So, and as I said, just one. Like other notebooks have a few, but this one only has one on the cover page. Then you open it up, and here you can see the dot grid paper. I think it's ivory colored. It says ivory colored off white. And um, here you can see the, the binding stitched and bound. And the notebook does feel pretty sturdy. Um, it doesn't feel like it's going to fall apart anytime soon. It has 80 sheets or 160 pages, as you can see. And then in the back, it explains you different note-taking take methods, so how you can organize your notes. And then it has a pocket in the back. It's a little bit thicker paper there. And then it has this cut right here. If you know what this is for, please enlighten me. And like maybe for business cards or something. But if you know, please do let me know. I'm really curious. So as I said, here's the pocket. There's the back again. Um, let's check out the writing sample. So it is 100 gram paper. So it has a really nice thickness to it. As you can see right there. And the paper quality is fantastic. I think it is up there with a Rhodian notebook or a Clairefontaine, the Clairefontaine paper. Um, so if you like the Rhodia paper but you actually want the Moleskin format, this might definitely be a notebook worth checking out. So here is pencil, ballpoint pen, 0.4 millimeter gel pen. 0.7 millimeter gel pen and here we have the Pilot Metropolitan medium nib Diamond Marine ink and as you can see there's absolutely no feathering whatsoever 
And the paper is fairly smooth. This is just like Rhodia paper. Maybe just not quite as glossy, but it is fairly smooth. And it feels just as nice. So, let's check out the back. There is hardly any ghosting. Just a tad. And then here is the ghosting a little bit of the fountain pen. is absolutely no bleed through. So it is excellent for fountain pens. So really, really, really good paper quality. I'm very pleasant, pleasantly surprised. So this notebook is made in Turkey, which might also speak for its quality. And um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I like this notebook a lot. I love the fact that it has um, a pen loop right there. So you can put your pencil or fountain pen or whatever you use for writing right there and not lose it or, you know, yeah, forget about it. And then, as I said, it lies open pretty flat. Let me show you that real quick. There you go. See, it's a really flat writing surface. It's very nice, too. Uh, yeah, a great notebook. Great quality. I like it a lot. And I highly recommend it, especially if you are a fountain pen user and you like this format. Definitely one worth checking out. So if you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment. Uh, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And for more notebook videos, videos subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.